Hello and welcome! Today I'm gonna to show you how to make this. Well, not directly this, as I have put everything on a billion, so it looks nice. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna make this a life preserver wonderfully floating on the ocean. So, first, make a new document. We're gonna delete the default cube and add a plane. We're gonna give it an ocean modifier. Let me go to waves and give it some wave thingies. Okay, perfect. You know, we're going to animate this thing because currently it's not doing anything. We go to time and press I to make one little keyframe. Perfect. Now go somewhere and set this thing to, I don't know, something like four. There we go. We're going to press I again. And now, and now we have wonderful moving ocean. Now, of course, we're going to add a wonderful life preserver from the last video, which of course is somewhere above me. There we go. So also let's change it so we can see something. We only see it's well floating, which of course is good. But of course, normally it's not well moving. So... It's not the stuff we want, so we're gonna add another plane. This one will be the important one, as we're gonna give it a modifier. We're gonna give it a shrink wrap modifier and put it on our first plane. So it will be on top of the plane all the time. Next up, we're gonna make a vertex group. We're gonna press tap, and then we're gonna assign it. Perfect, now let's go into our Taurus because that thing also needs some restraints. We're gonna add P location. We're gonna use a one plane and choose the vertex group. Also, what we're gonna need is the rotation, so we're gonna do the same. We're gonna select the plane and, of course, the group. And if you play this now back, we can see Wonderful Taurus is wonderfully on waves, and with that, it is moving. We're gonna animate this as well, so we're gonna press I and give it a location. We're gonna move somewhere else and, well, move it somewhere. So let's go around here, and then we're gonna do it again, give it a location. And if you now play it, you can see. The Taurus is moving on the plane a little bit fast, but well, you can fine tune it as you want. Something that you also might look out for is something like this. The Taurus is currently pretty deep below, but of course, you can go into the offset and just move it up a bit so it's just a little bit higher on or below. You can also make it on the full, let's make it blue. There we go. And with that, uh, we have our tutorial done. I hope you liked it, and I hope I'm gonna see you next time.